Ah, thanks for stopping by. The plan is about to enter its final stage, thanks to you and your predecessors. I wanted to express my gratitude. You seem rather perplexed by my words. But surely Sakura and Alyssa have contacted you by now. Well, I can imagine how you must feel, now that they've been put on the wanted list. Now, you're probably wondering how on earth I can still be loitering about the den. I'll not make excuses. If you wish to cross swords with me right now, I'll be glad to accommodate you. However, you must understand, the Ark Project is the only way for us to achieve both a true rebirth for the planet and human preservation. Let me see. For example, let's say that your ship has sunk and you and another passenger have been tossed into the raging sea. In the stormy waters, you see a single plank floating nearby. No matter how you look at it, the plank will sink if you both cling to it. Now then, what would you do? Would you push the other person aside and save yourself? Or are you the type who would gladly sacrifice himself? You're one of the people who should cling to this plank of Carneades. For the future of humankind, that is absolutely the right choice to make. The Ark will be completed in a short time. If you decide to join this project, I want you to fulfill your remaining duties to the best of your ability. And if you succeed, I intend to welcome you and your loved ones aboard the Ark as crew members. Now, what are you going to do? Board a doomed, sinking ship and wait for violent death in a stormy sea? Or, join me on board the Ark? Oh, by the way, Kota was just here minutes ago to receive his boarding ticket for the Ark. I'm proud of how strong he's become, just from having loved ones to protect. If you can't make up your mind now, I'll be happy to give you some time to mull it over. We're just one step away from setting the project in motion. Yes, if we can just get our hands on the singularity. I hope that I'll be reunited with you in the new world. That you'll accept an official ticket. Let's get started. I'm going to join the battle! You can't let me go by the Thank you. 
Control the battle! We can't let you go by yourself. Yeah.
Mission cleared. Whatever shows up, just slash it to hell. Everyone, make sure you haven't forgotten anything. Let's just call it a day. And that's when it comes charging right at you! Right! Right! So you quickly dodge it like this, and BAM! I won. Wow! You're just like Isamu on the Bugarelli TV show! Aren't I, though? Your big brother's got awesome power, so you have nothing to worry about. Okay. Really, now? What are you saying? Of course we were worried. Oh, come on. I promise you, it'll be all right. Well, I... I know I don't have to worry when you're home. You can take some time off, can't you? Uh... Yeah. Hey, big brother! Did you bring me anything? Oh, right! I forgot! I've got some news for you that's absolutely huge! It's still a secret, but... They're working on an amazing project! And with this magic ticket... We can all live together, forever! Really? Yeah, it's true! We can all live together? You too, big brother? Mom too? Right! Yuki, and now, and Hiro too? Huh? Oh, um, probably. Yay, that's great! Mom, did you hear that? We can all be safe! Yes, if it's true, then I'll be very happy! <gasps> <laughs> We can live together, right? Yes. <laughs> Koda can live with us, right? Yes. <laughs> I... You made the right decision. I... lied to everyone. I know what it is that you're after. What made you put your life on the line? and head for the battlefield where death is your constant companion. No, Zomi. Mom. I'm the one who has to protect them. And I know how to attain it. All you have to do, it will be yours, if you choose. What to discard, and what to pick up. That's why I... I chose. Congratulations. Your family will be saved now. At the expense of everyone else, huh? 